Hello everyone. In a typical production shop floor, quality control inspectors monitor the attributes of material quality and reach a decision to either accept or reject. Type 1 and Type 2 errors are quite commonly known for such type of QC procedures in which there is a risk of accepting a bad quality product or rejecting a good quality product. Here, we consider the impact of selecting a bad quality product as error committed by inspector. A penalty cost is imposed for such mistake by inspectors. Inspectors are graded based on their skill and high skilled inspectors have higher wages while they offer high inspection output rate and better acceptance rate. The objective of problem is to minimize total wages and error cost resulting from acceptance of bad quality products. The first constraint is on number of inspectors available for each grade. Other constraint is on minimum amount of pieces that must be shipped in each shift. Pulp and Pandas packages on operations research solver and data manipulation in Python are loaded. Along with the packages data is loaded. Inspectors list defines the grades of workers performing inspection. Number of inspectors list, wage per hour list, rate per hour list and accuracy rate list defines number of grade workers available, wage per hour for each grade. Output rate per hour and accuracy percentage of output. Further, there is error cost of $3, shift time of 8 hours and minimum output requirement of 1,500 units per shift. A list wage per shift list is calculated by multiplying wage per hour with shift time of 8 hours. Error cost per shift list is calculated by multiplying error cost with output rate, shift time rate per hour and error rate for each grade inspectors. Error rate is obtained by subtracting accuracy rate which is in proportion from 1. Accuracy output per shift list is computed by multiplying rate per hour with shift time and accuracy rate for grade inspectors. Next data frames are used in the model, for wage per shift, error cost per shift, Accuracy output per shift and number of inspectors for each grade inspectors. These are stored under wage per shift DF, error cost per shift DF, accuracy per shift DF and number of inspectors DF as data frames. We create a class QC inspector allocation for minimizing total cost of wages and error for accepting bad quality product. Then initialize the class with the method and feed the data and data frames to it instantly. Next, we define the problem as self.probe. The integer variable self.x is for determining number of quality inspectors for each grade. After declaring the variables objective function is defined. The objective function is the summation of variable self.x which is number of inspectors for each grade and is multiplied with parameters of wage per shift. Self.x is multiplied with error cost in a shift to get error cost in objective function. The first constraint defines that number of grade inspectors allocated is less than or equal to available inspectors for each grade. The second constraint is cumulative summation of output per shift of each grade inspectors to be at least equal to minimum requirement per shift which is 1500. The formulated problem is then invoked for solving with solve method. Please note we also write a .lp file, which is a good way of checking accuracy of model with data. Along with it we get the status, objective value and variables value for the problem. The formulated model is solved by invoking the solver. The optimal solution suggests selecting 10 number of grade 1 inspectors. This would cost $592 per shift. The code for the problem in this tutorial and previous tutorial are shared publicly on GitHub. The links are under the respective videos. Thank you for watching the video and please subscribe to the channel.